screen at the Popcorn Bowl. You're yeah. looking here at some incredible pumpkin par carvings. Good morning, everyone. You're watching the early show here. We're going to get to those pumpkin carvings a little bit later. I'm Eric Kipongoy. Thanks. Yes. Check in now. Just about 10 minutes past the hour. Lonnie Quinn standing outside on a beautiful fall day with a little check of the weather for us. Hey, you know, Erica, from politics to pumpkins, you make the transition. It's a little chilly out here, isn't it, guys? Yeah. Yeah, it's a little chilly. And you know what? If you take a look at the, map, the national map, you're going to find chilly but beautiful skies for the East Coast. It's the West Coast. where Most locations, but we will warm up to a high of about 66 degrees today, that is. Tomorrow on your Sunday, 67. But then temps drop back down with a lot of cloud cover and a chance of showers on your Monday with a high of just 63. Plenty of sunshine. All right, check this out. Who doesn't love a good jack-o'-lantern? Guys, this morning, we're going to carve our own little niche into the presidential predictions with what's called the pumpkin pole. Better Homes and Gardens provides you with a stencil to carve your favorite candidate's face right on the pumpkin. Yvette Rios Hi. joining us right now to, nice to show us how it's done. And, and Yvette, thanks for coming by, but how do the people at Better Homes and Gardens, who are behind this whole thing, right. how do they determine who's going to win the presidential race with that jack-o'-lantern? Well, you know, historically, when presidential candidates' masks have been sold, usually the highest seller is the next president. So this is our little fun take on, uh, on oh. Halloween. So yeah. You, so you track it online, I'm imagining. Exactly. The steps? Better Homes and Web Gardens website, bhg.com, and uh, you, we're going to track it right there. You download your template, oh, and these are them. what the templates look like. Here's Biden. Well, hey, no, let's show, let's show the pumpkins. Oh, okay, cool. Let's show the pumpkins. So we've got Sarah Palin over there. Sa looking fabulous, am I might Yeah, she yeah. looks great sure. with glasses and all. And? John McCain. I like it. <laughs> Barack Obama, mm -hmm. and of course, Joe Biden. You know what? I, Joe Biden's the only one I don't think really looks like Joe. And he looks just like him. Oh. you got to see him from the front. Well, let me show you what the <laughs> techniques are to carve. So no, you, you, you know what? You know what, honey? Listen, we're going to maybe do a little bit of this during the break here, but okay. uh, we're going to wrap it up here because I want to let people know where they can get a stencil for themselves. Okay. All you got to do is just go to our website, earlyshow.cbsnews.com, and you can download your own stencil there. You'll be connected to the Better Homes and Gardens website. So thank you very, thank very you. much, Erica. Chris, Erica, into you guys. Much, Lonnie. Appreciate it. Can't wait to see his jack o' lantern a little bit later on in the broadcast. We need a Lonnie we've got a, we've, we do, we do. We have a Lonnie Quinn stencil. It's on the way. <laughs> Still ahead here on the early show. Do you rummage through your wife's purse or open your husband's mouth? <laughs> Good lord, oh. I hope not. I mean, seriously, you got more problems. It happens, then. though. Our relationship experts, though, here to tell you if it's ever okay to spy on your spouse. You probably know the answer. We've got some tips. You're watching the early show on CBS. This weather segment.